I want, there's three things that are my mantra. Quality, flexibility, and speed. It has to be the highest possible quality, because if you're willing to sacrifice quality, then go ahead and get into politics or medicine or, you know. Get, yeah, just kidding. My doctor doesn't like that. Uh, quality should be paramount, right? That's why you're artists. That's why you got into this, you know. Um, flexibility, your ability to change anything at any time. That's the beauty of Lightroom. Since it's completely non-destructive, every single thing you can undo and everything you can share. If you've got one image, we're going to be doing that after the break. I want to automatically apply it to 50 other images, do it. So flexibility. Last one is speed. Okay, why do something in Photoshop that may be half a dozen layers, adjustment layers and layer masks, when you can do that all with just a few clicks? As an example, that radial filter. I can do uh, my tone, my sharpening, my clarity, my saturation. I'm doing all of these things in one adjustment. If I did that in Photoshop, I would have to do six different adjustments. I would have to apply a soft edge mask to each one of those or put them into a folder and mask the folder and yada, yada, yada. You will work infinitely faster working in Lightroom. As I mentioned before, by the end of these three days, you will no longer be using Photoshop for levels or curves or color or tone or basic, even now basic retouching. You'll never do a black and white conversion in Photoshop again. Remember, you have access to all your raw data, so your quality in terms of these potential billions of colors. Remember, your raw file isn't even pixels yet. That's sensor data. You're even pre-pixel. So your quality is going to be better. Every time you go into Photoshop, it's pixels. So, you know, anyway, it's giving me chicken skin, as we say in Hawaii, right? It is so cool.